Hey my good friends, Sam Haymart with Test Driven TV. We've recently test driven the all new Honda Accord Hybrid. So we're popping the hood and doing a full underhood tour outlining all of the major technical features as well as the maintenance service points. The 2023 Honda Accord Hybrid we tested features an all new fourth generation two motor hybrid powertrain with 204 horsepower and 247 pound feet of torque. In our test vehicle, it's rated by the EPA at 46 miles per gallon city, 41 miles per gallon highway, and 44 miles per gallon combined. The powertrain is comprised of an all-aluminum 2-liter Atkinson cycle 4-cylinder engine with direct fuel injection and variable cam timing. It's mated to a new hybrid drive system with larger and more powerful electric motors now mounted side-by-side -side in the assembly. The new traction motor itself offers up 181 horsepower which affords the Accord Hybrid strong electric-only operation of up to 29 miles per hour. The engine itself features an electric water pump and the air conditioning compressor is powered by the high voltage battery. As the generator motor in the transmission takes care of all of the charging of the battery, this means there are no belt driven accessories on the engine. Thermal efficiency and low emissions are also major features of this engine, which has a cooled exhaust gas recirculation system clearly visible at the front. There's also a new low temperature active catalyst with a low level of noble materials that drops the nitrous oxide emissions by 24% and total hydrocarbon emissions by 22%, giving Accord Hybrids a level 3 super low emission vehicle 30 rating. Following the airflow, the intake charge starts at the front of the engine compartment at the top of the radiator, then travels through an ornate intake plenum mounted on top of the hybrid transmission and the control unit. From there, it travels down into a compact air filter box at the rear of the engine compartment, and then into a composite plastic intake manifold at the rear of the engine. Coming over the top, all four spark plug coil packs are easily seen and accessed. Much of the direct fuel injection system, though, is hidden from view. Once the combustion process is complete, exhaust gas exits through an integral exhaust manifold built into the head and directly into the aforementioned catalyst system. Servicing the Accord Hybrid in DIY maintenance is pretty straightforward. The air filter does take some effort to get into, but can be changed with common tools in about 15 minutes of effort. The oil filler cap is located at the top of the engine on the passenger side, the bright yellow dipstick just ahead of it in plain view. The oil filter is only reachable from below. Checking and topping off coolant and windshield washer fluid is handled at the passenger side front of the engine compartment. The main 12 volt battery is located at the driver side front of the engine bay, the engine control unit just next to it. Further back to the right is a sizable fuse box. Brake fluid can be topped off and checked at the driver's side rear of the engine compartment. As with all hybrid cars, do avoid mishandling that orange high voltage wiring as it carries enough voltage to injure you or even cause death in the right circumstances. Most of those components really aren't user serviceable anyway. Additionally, looking forward, you can see the electric cooling fan behind the radiator. Always be mindful that it can start at any time if the vehicle's been driven and is warm. Well, there you go, under the hood of the all-new 2023 Honda Accord Hybrid. We have a test drive on this vehicle. You can see that right there. You can also subscribe to our YouTube channel right there and stay informed of all of our nuts and bolts stuff that we do here. Either way, stay tuned.